Yes. <laughs> Let's get to it. All presented by Stone Academy. Yeah, in Royals news, the wedding is just three weeks away for Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. I know you are excited. We're pumped up. We're ready to go. And today we're taking you inside the Windsor Chapel where the couple will be tying the knot. So here it is, Windsor Castle, home to kings and queens for nearly thousands, uh, uh, for a thousand years. Uh, and within its grounds, St. George's Chapel, where many members of the family have been christened, married, and yes, even buried throughout the years. All right, so when Megan enters the church on the big day, she'll be at the mm -hmm. west door beneath a stained glass window. The whole area fits about 600 people. It's a lot of wedding guests. Beautiful right there. And with the words, I do, an American celebrity will become British royalty. It's going to be a I big day. That happens, huh? I, I'm still waiting on my invite, though. Have I you? think it's too late. They went out a while ago. Oh, all right, <laughs> you didn't make the cut this, next this time. Next go around. I don't know. Maybe one of the kids coming up. All right. So going back to the 90s with your favorite boy band, mm. which was? Uh, were you alive for this? Come on. I, I was a I 90s know. kid. Of course I was okay, alive. I didn't know if you were listening. I, I had the NSYNC CD. Oh, good. I wasn't a Backstreet Boys fan. It was all about NSYNC and, and JT back in the day, and that's what we're talking about today. They were inducted to the... Star Hollywood Walk of Fame. The boy band, of course, blew up the scene. Backstreet Boys were first, so they came to the scene first. And NSYNC were You're started wrong. by the same manager. New kids okay. on the block yeah. were first. That's old kids <laughs> on the block. That's old news. I'm, I'm talking about the two biggest all boy right. bands. So they got their Walk of Fame. There you go. No reunion, though. They put all the reunion talk to bed. That's kind of not sad. happening. I mean, the Backstreet Boys are touring all over the place. I think NSYNC should do the, the same thing. But I think the big takeaway, two letters at least, JT. I mean, that was the... Yeah, the, the start it's of Justin like, Timberlake. Kind of like the Beyonce of Destiny's yeah, Child. Exactly. Just took off exactly. and didn't look back. Do you have a favorite NSYNC song? Um, it's oh, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. Bye, 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 right? Is that, or was that the other group? No, that was Bye, bye, yeah, bye. That I like was that. NSYNC. All right. Okay. Anywho, if you could be a superhero for a day, mm -hmm. who would you pick, Ryan? My favorite is Ant Man. That's not real. That's my, It's a superhero, right, Tom? Yes. Yes, oh. it is a superhero. Oh, I'm sorry, it's I not my favorite. Okay. What is it, the powers of Ant Man? He shrinks to the size of an ant. <laughs> That's what you'd like to do. Yeah, and he gets into all your your food in the summertime. I, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. But but Batman. This is a very heartwarming story beyond my Ant Man infatuation. All right. This is a little guy. Make a Wish Foundation help Aww. dreams come true here. This little guy's name is Ivan. Uh, he lives out in Las Vegas, and the six-year-old was born with EBD, which is a rare disease that causes his fragile skin to blister. Aww. So they were able to put a huge smile across his face. How about that ride he's got there? He's got huh? the Batmobile. That's that fantastic. He got a limo ride, a shopping spree, and Batman toys galore. I'm driving. I'm going to shoot bad guys. <laughs> <laughs> So Ivan's mom said it was an awesome moment there for him. And now we're going to move on to a little sand sculpture action here. The warmer, uh, the weather is getting a little bit warmer. Almost beach time. Almost. Almost. I mean, we're going to have 80s later this week, but the water will be way too cold. We're hoping for it at least. But down <laughs> in Texas. Oh, my. Look at that. Doing their thing. How about that? I, I think that's like the most uncomfortable thing when you're buried under the sand. I don't typically like beach. I prefer a pool because pool. of the sand. You're a pool girl. I don't like the sand that gets everywhere. Are, are, you, are your kids assimilated with the beach yet, or are they pool? Yeah, they've been to the beach, but kids. they too prefer the pool, I think, because okay. I don't like cleaning up the sand everywhere. All right. 